Hello there, welcome to the October 2020 applied paper. Here we're looking at question one. The histogram in figure one shows the times taken to complete a crossword by a random sample of students. This the number of students who completed the crossword in more than 15 minutes is 78. Estimate the percentage of students who took less than 11 minutes to complete the crossword. So what we could do here, and just remember the key for histogram questions is that it's the area of the boxes that represent the frequency. And we don't have the, the scale on the frequency density uh, axis, so it's going to be a little bit difficult to work out the areas of these bars. But another strategy for frequency for, for uh, histograms is to work out the area of the um, bars by working out how many boxes are in each bar. So what I know is that from this 15 to upwards is going to represent 78 people. So what I now need to work out is how many boxes represent 78 people. So I can work with either area or number of boxes because number of boxes will add up to make the whole area. So it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 36, plus 40, 44, 48, 50, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 15 upwards uh, equals 78 people. So if we now divide by 72, we're going to get 1.5 people per box. Okay, so now what we want to work out is the um, number of students who scored 11 minutes or less. So that would require us to divide this box in half and go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So that's going to be 16 boxes, which will probably correspond to 24 people. We times it by 1.5, yeah, 24 people. And now what we want to do to finish the question is estimate the percentage of students who took 11 minutes or less. So it's going to be these 24 people out of the total, so we have 24 people here, um, let's work out how many people we've got here, we've got 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, so 20 boxes will be worth 30 people, so it's going to be 24 out of 24 plus 30 plus 78, and then multiply that by 100 to make it into a percentage, and we get 18.18, so 18%. So or 18.2% if you're rounding into three significant figures. So there we are, that's the answer for this question here. So just a reminder that histograms represent, uh, histograms uh, will have area equals uh, frequency, so you have to work out the area of each box as the key for this question. So there we are, that's the answer for question one, worth four marks in total. Let's move on to question two.